came up from nothing. You can't tell me. Yeah, did it on my own. Check out my neck, check out my wrist. Yeah. I swear I ain't never expected it to be like this. Now I'm getting rich. I swear every day we live. Yeah. Every day we live. Yeah. It is absolutely beautiful. The weather is absolutely nice. 81 degrees. It feels hotter, but oh well. But this is our last day here, y'all. Oh my gosh. Like, we've been having such a good time. And it's been a long nine days. It's been long, hot, plus a few rainy days. It's been so, 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 so fun. But all good things must come to an end, unfortunately. So we're going to enjoy the private island and we're going to grab something to eat and then probably look around a little bit and then take some pictures and then head back to the boat. We don't want to keep Maddie out in the sun too long because, you know, sunburn and all that. But other than that, it's so beautiful here, y'all. Like, I need to move to the Caribbean like ASAP. I need to move to the Bahamas or Jamaica or somewhere. Another thing I want to tell y'all is Caribbean people, I love... I love the accents here. I love people from the islands, their accents. Like it's so, it's so beautiful. No, I'm a, but they have some beautiful women here. I'll tell you that. Like, I mean, just beautiful, dark, melon. I mean, it, beautiful skin, just beautiful women here. So it's very, very nice overall. But anywho, let me finish walking this beach and then, <laughs> walking this beach. <laughs> and then I'm gonna go back over there to meet the family. Every day we live, yeah. Huh? Oh my god. You just 
want to sing or dance? <laughs> right here and dance. I cannot believe it's already time to head back to Merlin. Yes, but we had such a great time. This is our third cruise together, and I think the food, I think the food is so good on the The food has been amazing on this cruise. Okay, like I had this, what's it called? Any and or something i don't know what the name of it. it was some fancy it was some fancy dish it pretty much it's rice and mushrooms and it had like this breading topping on it and it had spinach and um, marinara sauce and it was so good oh my god it was so good and um the eggplant it tasted so good it tasted like how i made it i was like okay <laughs> So yeah, it was so good, but the food is really, really good. I don't know what is going on with my camera, y'all. Like, it keeps stopping for some reason. I don't know. <sighs> the struggle. But yes, y'all, it has been real. The Bahamas was beautiful, just how it was the last time we came here. Coco Key was amazing. Now it's time to head back home. I started packing earlier. As you can see, our stuff is still out. But we have to put our stuff outside because they have to collect it and all that. And yeah, so they... <laughs> Big man, she's over here sleeping. She's already bathed and all that. We had went out to go look to see what movie was playing, but we came back because she just started getting fussy and stuff. But she wanted to wear her little kid heels. We saw the pictures from formal night, and they are so beautiful. Like, I'm gonna post some on my Instagram, so if you're not following, make sure that you are following it, okay? But other than that, y'all, it's been a great time. I hope you guys enjoy all the footage. Like I said, I'm sorry I didn't talk much because it was for one hot, then it rained, then we're just all over the place, and it was tired, and all that. Oh, uh, really? <laughs> He's so silly. There's no mirror behind this. Huh? There's no mirror behind this. Oh. Maybe we're just in the bathroom. Make sure you have our passports, please. Oh. <laughs> He's just mad. Cause I, I, I was trying to explain it to y'all before my camera cut off when we first got here. But we had to go back to Orlando from Port Canaveral because somebody decided to leave our passport and his wallet in the safe 
back at our resort in Orlando. So not only did we drive an hour to Port Canaveral and he realized that we didn't have he did he realized he didn't have it because he was looking for stuff and he wasn't there, only to realize he left it in the safe. So we had to get a cab, go all the way back to Orlando, which is like an hour and some change, go let him handle that, turn around and come all the way back before three o'clock. So we made it and we were tired, but the struggle was too real. All thanks to the big guy. Tell them what you did. What did I do? To get our stuff ready. Today? No. When before we were leaving Orlando. Tell them what you packed. My stuff? Yeah. Half your stuff. Whatever. <laughs> Tell them what I did. Packed your stuff? Everything. No. <laughs> Except the passports. Yeah, I forgot one thing. <laughs> Two. <laughs> yeah, two things that he needed. I forgot to empty the safe. That's one thing. Mm -hmm. hey, you didn't. You didn't remind me. Well, I don't know what to, I don't know what to tell you. No. I'm fine. All right, you guys. So other than that, we. <laughs> he is a fool. So we'll see you guys when we get back to Maryland. Hey you guys, so we are home now, home sweet home, woohoo, I'm just kidding, but yes, we are home now, it was a long day y'all, our, um, so yeah, our plane was delayed because it was storming here in Baltimore, so we were delayed about, what, an hour, almost two hours were delayed. Our plane was overbooked, so four to five people had to get off. So we actually volunteered, but they already had their volunteers. It would have been nice to be selected as long as we were able to get home. But you know, it kind of worked out because we got home later, didn't expect it because of the delay. And if we were to volunteer, you know, if we were to actually get selected as the volunteers to give up our spot, then we would have gotten home way later. Later. so kind of worked out in our favor that we weren't selected because now we're home and we are tired y'all like I mean are you see our stuff is just sitting here until we get the strength and the energy to unpack so we'll do that tomorrow and we have to go pick up our fish because my girl Britt was nice enough to fish sit so we gotta pick up our babies tomorrow and then it's back to life well it's back to life until this weekend. I'm just got home from Florida. Now I'm going back to Florida. I'll be flying to Miami for the weekend and I need to rest up and get my energy back in order because yes, I need to rest up so I can get ready for her fun. And daddy was trying to make me eat sweets this late. So I'm about to. Late. Yeah. So yeah, I need to rest up so I can get my energy because it's gonna be a fun but crazy weekend. So I hope you guys have been enjoying the footage and we'll see you guys in the next vlog. So thank you all so much for watching and as usual, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And we'll talk to you in another video. Bye. Peace.